What's up, you guys? This is AJ Dam back with another Every Marvel Legends video. This time we're talking about every vintage Marvel Legends. So the first vintage wave we had consisted of Wolverine, Black Widow, Cap, Punisher, Spider-Man, and Iron Man. So there's Black Widow. We always called this one the Mary Jane head, but I like this body better than the majority of them that we've seen. This is the cap. He's got the throwing shield. Would have liked to have seen the chainmail actually be molded instead of painted on. Here's the Iron Man. Uh, improving upon the feet that were on the original version of this guy back in the Epic Heroes wave. Here's the Punisher. Very similar to the Walgreens. Almost exactly the same except the headband is red instead of white. Here's the Pizza, pizza Spidey re-released again. Brown suited Wolverine. This time though we get him with an unmasked head and the mask being able to fold behind his head. That's a pretty cool addition to that one. So the Wave 2 of the Vintage came with the Hawkeye, Black Panther, Ant-Man, Wasp, Vision, and Scarlet Spider-Man. So the Ant-Man came with a tiny wasp figure. Black Panther came with a couple of effects and a couple of hand changes with that necklace as well. This is the Hawkeye, pretty much the exact same Hawkeye as we had before, except this time he has a uh, his arm, both arms wide open instead of having armor across it. This is the wasp that we all wanted or uh, desired back in the Toy Biz days, but it was a very rare release. So this is a blue suit or blue costume. And then he, she came with a tiny Ant-Man. Here's the Vision, and he came with an Ultron head. And here is the Scarlet Spider. And the difference between this Scarlet Spider and the one that came in the other waves, uh, number one is it comes with an alternate head with the blonde version of Ben Riley. Uh, number two, the red on him is actually more of a metallic or a darker red. And the spider logo on his chest is actually a bigger logo on this one. So the third vintage wave was actually the X-Men vintage wave. Consisted of a Ninja Wolverine, White Storm, White Costume Storm that is, a Dazzler, a Cyclops, First villain we've seen, Silver Samurai, and Iceman. So here is the Storm. Here's the Cyclops. This is more of an X-Factor Cyclops, and he comes with several different head sculpts with the ability to uh, see his, his uh, powers in action. Here's that Ninja Wolverine with his sword. The Iceman with a tiny little ice effect. One of the best here, Silver Samurai. So glad we got this guy. And also this version of Dazzler. I really love this particular version. I like the one we got with Skates as well, but this was a really uh, good iteration of her as well. So then we got the SDCC exclusive Hulk figure with the lead pipe. This is a giant carded figure here. And this is also a vintage card back here. So these two actually came out of nowhere. They just threw these out there, uh, were released to the public before they were even released in media, was this vintage Deadpool X-Force with the red. It's kind of just a repaint. Um, and also the Vintage Grey Hulk. So these are pretty awesome releases, uh, but they definitely just came out of nowhere. So Hasbro's kind of been losing their ability to advertise before the things are shown up to, to consumers first. And this Hulk is probably the best of the four. Eh. Maybe Red Hulk is, but this is a great Hulk too.
and then announced at that German Comic Con in Dortmund, we had Black Storm, Black Costume Storm, which is the repaint of the White Costume Storm. So it was good, definitely needed, but we hopefully will be getting a better storm here even even sooner than later. Haven't seen her in package yet, but uh, she was announced that we are getting her. So announced at Toy Fair 2020, we are having a Spider-Man vintage wave coming out. We only know of three so far. Uh, Shown at 2020 Toy Fair, we have the Spider-Man himself with an alternate head. This is a new sculpt. has a lot of different articulation than we've ever seen on these Spider-Man figures. Next, we have the Peter Parker with his glasses and his camera and jacket. Also has an alternate head with the half mask, half Parker, like his spider sense is working. And then we have the Gwen Stacy with the alternate Mary Jane head. So really excited about these. Uh, Spider-Man figures, especially this Gwen Stacy. And just announced, we have another fan channel exclusive vintage card back. We have the Gray Beast. Comes with the glasses and a book and an alternate head. This thing looks amazing. Can't wait to get this one. Go pre-order it now. So here is the new fan channel exclusive vintage card back. Mysterio repaint that we're getting. And in my opinion, this looks so much more classic, so much more perfect than the original Mysterio that we got last year. I'm very excited about this figure. And just announced, we have another fan channel exclusive. This one is a deluxe vintage card. Kingpin. This is from the animated series back in the day, the paint scheme that we have on this guy. Got a second head sculpt and his cane again this time. The second head sculpt has got the beat up look to him. Black eye, cut lip, cut over his eye. It's pretty awesome. So here are all of the vintage figures loose. You can compare them all. And here they all are in package. And let's not forget my favorite part of the videos, the most wanted or the wish list for the vintage. How about a Punisher van? Or a armored Daredevil? Or even the Inhumans like Gorgon, Korvac, and Triton that we haven't seen yet. The armored Spider-Man, classic Doctor Strange, or even a Rogue again. And how about let's bring on some bad guys, most wanted. Atuma, Alistair Smythe. Annihilus, Emma Frost and her white again, Mandarin, Wizard, Classic Scorpion, Shaw, Toad, Mesmero, Arcade. What you guys think about these? So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave any kind of comments. Hit that notification bell so you're aware of any new videos that I have. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit that thumbs up. Share this video with your friends. Check out my other Every Marvel Legends videos, also my top 10 list. Also check out my son, Zach Legends channel. He has lots of figure reviews from Marvel Legends and news. And I will talk to you guys later. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. You can find all the photos that you want of these videos.